What is going on YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to take a look at three hanger boxes from the 2022-23 UEFA Superstar set from Topps. These launched on Topps' website for about 15 bucks and we're here to show you, you know, what these are about. Uh, this is going to be a complete opposite video of the in-depth review to the blasters uh, from the set. So it's going to be fairly quick and uh, yeah, let's get right into it guys. If you enjoy this kind of content and want to see more, consider dropping a like down below and subscribing if you haven't already. It really helps out the channel and it really helps us grow. So, you have, what is it, 4x8 format, 32 cards total, and yeah, just like the other one, there's no odds on the back, so let's just put this to the side. And we are expecting to see two non-numbered Mystic Parallels from these, and besides that, everything should be similar to the Blaster, besides the uh, Relics and Relic Autos, so you cannot get those from these, those are exclusive to the Blaster boxes, and there's Julian Alvarez's base. Uh, you are going to be getting a lot of these yellows, so yeah, we already have like three in that one pack. So here's our first Molten Rare. So this is the rarest out of the non-numbereds, and these are not like guaranteed technically. I just realized there's like a pattern on the background here too. I thought it was like only the outline, so that's kind of cool. I didn't notice it in the previous video, but there's Jan Oblak, Vinny Jr., and the rest is just base. So yeah. What are we going to be able to see from these guys? This set is really rough, as we discussed in the previous video. And by rough, I mean, like, you know, the value just isn't really there. Like, it's... Ooh, what is this? Oh, man, I thought... Like, so the dark color really throws you off. So these are guaranteed per hanger box. But... Uh, or, like, even two. I think we're getting two. But it's just, like, really nice because it's black. You know, when, typically when you see a black border, it's either for Panini, it's like... A one of one or for tops it's anywhere from 75 all the way down to like 15 or 10 sometimes but hey this one looks really cool with the inter milan colors one of my favorite players of all time so let's put them over here for what it's worth even though it's probably not worth that much but if this is your first superstars video uh then you're gonna notice that these kind of say the rarity at the bottom so this one says uncommon and we're gonna put this so let's might as well separate them now so we don't have to do it at the end but yeah, I don't know if you guys can see this on the yellows, but it says common. So that's why you're getting so many of these. And pack number three. So the feel of these packs actually is not like your typical soccer sets. These have kind of like a semi-waxy feel to them. I mean, we are in a junk wax era 2.0 in a way. And there's our Elite Focus insert. Not too, uh, not too rare, not too common. You know, just kind of expect to see these a lot uh, in terms of foil inserts. And they are kind of like thicker than the typical insert. So let's put that one over there. And we got two more, three more yellows and two base as expected. Yeah, getting an auto from one of these, especially for the price is really crazy, but you know, it is gonna be fairly difficult. You know, you're not really gonna see autos flying left and right and i don't know how many in a case there are but there's Vinny. all right so we're doing really well for the mystics the hanger box exclusives and these actually look really sick it's just really a shame that they're you know that common and there is mark nelly on the uncommon green foil so that's our second one we got molten rare and then we got two uncommons so five foils or six foils total if you're including that. So let's see box number two. And actually, I'm going to try to speed this up even more because we've talked about most of the stuff from the set. Uh, if you haven't seen the video, check out the Blasters. Link in the description down below. Blasters, aka value box. And we did say that we're not actually going to do the display box because it just, you know, doesn't make sense for the price point. Might as well get a hobby box of the UCC flagship. There's Sobosly, and who's right behind him? His teammate. So Uncommon and Mystic. And I'm actually going to sleeve these probably eh, probably at the very end. It's just going to slow down the video if I keep doing it. So there's Mbappe base. And I've yet to see Messi or Ronaldo or Holland, even in like base, from at least what I've opened. So I've seen the Chase rookies. We've seen a lot of other players. There's Kimmich. Put them over here. Three yellows, two base. That's the name of the game. But yeah, 
I wasn't initially planning on, on reviewing these, but because it's, I don't wanna say it's like down season for product, but it's kind of slow. A lot of products have been delayed. So I had to like kind of reschedule some of the reviews. There's Valverde. Again, really nice looking Mystics. Just unfortunate, the rarity situation with all this. But there's Jack Grealish, probably still drinking on his, what, like one week now since they won. Hasn't changed uniform. All the videos I've seen of him, he's still in uniform. I mean, there's no way he hasn't changed. He's probably just like wearing a clean uniform because that stuff would stink after like one game. But I think we got a numbered card. So this one's should be out of 199 based on the pattern that I've seen in the past. So let's see who it is. It is Martin Odegaard. All right, love to see it for Arsenal. Let me show you guys the back. 191 out of 199. So we could have got something rarer, but hey, we have low expectations for this product. Let's just put this one over here. I wasn't expecting to get any numbered cards from these hangers actually, because I feel like they're advertising the Mystics a lot, but here's a rare, if you've never seen one before. Also has like a summer splash on it, and it says rare over here. Daichi Kamada and Garnacho base at the very end there. All right. Oh, we're out of packs. So last hanger box, and they call it hanger pack for some reason on the website. Let's get all the packs out. Put them over here and move this off screen. And fingers crossed we've seen auto because I've yet to see an auto pulled. I've seen these on eBay, but I haven't seen an auto pulled from these boxes and the autos are all chrome. So that's kind of nice. Oh, we got another numbered card. This one's out of 99. I mean, I act super excited just because, you know, for the, for what this product is, you're not really expecting to see a lot of numbered cards, but there's Leon Goretzka. This one should be out of 99. Yep, there it is. And, you know, might as well mention what all the numbered cards are and possibilities are, because I know I skipped over that. But um, uh, besides like all the non-numbered, so the Molten Rare is the rarest one. Then after that, you have the Super Rare Mint, that one out of 99, and then Ultra Rare Purple out of 99, Gold out of 50, Seismic Orange out of 25, Blue out of 10, Red Wave out of five, and the one of one Super Factor. So that's kind of what you can expect. And we got another Molten Rare. Let's put them over here with, a bunch of yellows. They might as well have just made all of the base yellows. But yeah, I really don't think they made a lot of these unless I am just completely mistaken. By a lot, I mean like, I don't know, 500,000 boxes or something. I don't think they do it for this kind of product, especially with the images they're using. But there's Milinkovic Savic. Really, really big fan of those Mystic parallels. And there's <laughs> Anthony. Who knows what's gonna happen with that guy now. Two packs left. No sign of an auto. I think we got an insert in this one. Yep. Those black borders. Decky Rice with the trophy. And he might be leaving West Ham. I don't know, actually. What do you guys think? If he does, where do you think he's gonna go? There is Saka, and this is a variation, I believe. Because the regular pictures would be kind of something like this, like a studio shot. And then this is numbered 440, yeah, so this is a variation. And you can get these in like purple out of 99. So they're not too crazy rare, but they're not like too crazy common. That is what it is. All right, there's Gavi. It's kind of a funny picture there. And last pack. I highly doubt we're going to get an autograph, but if you end up pulling one, I'd love to see it. Send us a message, share it on Discord or even share a link to your video. It should be fairly rare to see autographs of these. Okay, and our last mystic, behind Joao Felix, is gonna be Sergio Canales. I was gonna sleeve it, but I'm just gonna, <laughs> just gonna do that since we're on the last pack, and I think I mixed some of the cards that we pulled earlier. Dembele once again, and Julian Alvarez, common. Thank you for that, Tops, and Roberto Carlos. And, hmm. What do we do? I'm just gonna sleeve this guy because one of the chase rookies for what it's worth. I'm not gonna do a recap of the yellows, but I will show you all the different parallels that we got from uh, three different hangers. We got how many of these? One, two, three, four, five, six commons. And we got, so these should be two per hanger. One, two, three, four, five, six. Ronaldo, Nazario, Phenomeno. And we got a numbered card. And we got another numbered card. So two out of the three, maybe making up for one of the blaster boxes. This one's out of 99, that one's out of 199. 
And yeah, we got these three Elite Focus and one Summer Splash Rare. So yeah, honestly, these products are purely for fun in my opinion. Like if you're getting into these, don't have any sort of expectations so you don't end up like, I don't know, hating the, the set completely or being upset if you don't really get any numbered card or whatever, cause it does happen. But uh, yeah, just wanted to show you um, the product, kind of do a quick uh, overview of it. So uh, yeah, it's basically it. Uh, kind of keep it to, I don't know, maybe others who are just trying to go from match attacks to like flagship, trying to find a transition. This is probably it. So yeah, well, that's basically it guys. Hope you enjoyed this video. Hope you found it helpful. Uh, thanks for watching. And as always, we'll see you in the next one.